on by an absolute thread as a, as a League One club. Some of your feelings after after that today? It's heartbroken, really. You know, to, to to be in the situation we're in. It's personally, it's embarrassing. Really, you don't you don't become a footballer to be in these situations. And I've never had this like this before, and I don't intend to go through it again. And it's just it's a horrible feeling. And that's all I can say really at the moment. You're not quite down in terms of the six points to play for you, six points to drift, but in your heart of hearts, you're almost accepting the fact that it's likely the club are going to be in League Two very soon. Well, it's very unlikely that we're, we're, we're stay up, it's, it's out of our hands. Um, we need to win both and other teams to, to one out of three teams not to, to win any, which, you know, is still possible, but. It's, like I said, it's going to be very difficult playing a good Peterborough team next week who are, who are in the playoff positions and maybe to, to secure their playoff positions. But, you know, we still got to go in. You've got to have pride. You've got to be proud of yourself to, to be able to walk out onto a pitch and give everything. If you can't do that every week, doesn't matter what situation you're in, you don't deserve to, to be a footballer. And, you know, we're all in very fortunate situations of what we do. And, you know, given 100%, Given everything, given your heart, is, is the minimum you should give every week. And you know, if players are not going to go into the game on Saturday with that kind of mentality, they should be 